Good to be with you this Saturday night. Uh, we're well above freezing. We'll stay that way all night. Uh, 39 in Louisville right now. We had a high of 43 today. 21 was our low temperature this morning. I want to run down these snow totals for the season so far. We're all below normal uh, as our snow drought continues. Lexington, uh, number one in Kentucky, seven and a half inches. Covington's had 6.4. We're at 4.8 here in Louisville. And look at Ashland over in, by, near the Huntington, West Virginia area. Ashland, Kentucky, less than an inch of snow. So far this winter, that is incredible because they usually get more than we get here. Uh, South Bend, Indiana, whoa, 41 inches so far. They're right off that lake effect, the snow belt there, uh, and they're going to get a ton of snow tomorrow. Fort Wayne, 17 in the five, and Evansville, like us, in a snow drought, only 2.6 inches uh, over in southwest Indiana. There's been a little bit of snow to our north, about a half inch or so in Indianapolis this evening. That's all staying well north of us, and that's kind of the leading edge of the storm system that's lifting out. Uh, the main action, the heaviest snow right now. Now is in Nebraska and Iowa heading east and uh, further south in the warmer air. The rain that was what's heading our way. And uh, here's what it looks like in uh, Iowa, just in the Des Moines area this evening, snowing about an inch an hour there. And this is kind of like a perfect storm because you have the Super Bowl tomorrow, uh, you have the snow on the way. So Chicago. Uh, to Cleveland, to Pittsburgh. Uh, it was mob scenes at the grocery stores today. Here's the dairy case. All the milk is gone. It looked like uh, for your Super Bowl party, there's a little bit of, what is that, strawberry syrup there or something? <laughs> That's all that's left. But this is hundreds of grocery stores reporting this this evening as people uh, between the two events have just kind of been gone nuts there. All right, tomorrow morning, heavy snow, northern Indiana into Illinois. Here's the rain at St. Louis, generally just cloudy here. And as we get toward midday, the rain will begin to fire up. And uh, we'll see off and on and mostly on rain during the afternoon hours as the storm system passes by. Notice that snow line way up further north there. And then we'll see the rain ending during the evening hours. Now, watch late tomorrow night. Could see a little burst of snow move through here uh, before 6 a.m. and then uh, just kind of quiet down on Monday and dries out. Uh, but uh, we'll watch this closely and Suzanne will update this again for you tomorrow night because we could get a little quick burst of snow, like a half inch, inch, something like that. If that happens with temperatures falling through the 20s, that is going to. Uh, Cause some slick spots, so we'll see. Again, uh, we have shifted the heavy snow further north again. Indianapolis, kind of like New York, they start off at six to nine, went three to five. Now they'll stay probably an inch or less uh, for their snow. Ten to fifteen, northern Indiana, and uh, this is an eighty to ninety percent chance for a foot of snow up in northern Indiana. <laughs> Doesn't get much higher than that. And then that storm shifts east all the way to Boston. And here in Pennsylvania, Groundhog Day is Monday. And I was there a couple of years ago. And it was in the 50s, the day before Groundhog Day. By the way, Phil, they put Phil in this little heated room. They let him out uh, for the big event. Uh, but it's going to be pretty brutal conditions there in Punxsutawney by Monday morning. We're in the 40s tomorrow, 20s on Monday. Here comes the cold again. 37 tonight. Nothing going on out there, but rain tomorrow, midday through the afternoon, ending in the evening, and then a chance of that light snow tomorrow night. 20. Uh, the low, cold on Monday, only in the 20s. We'll warm it up midweek, and we get colder again. Later in the week. So, a little bit up and down weather pattern there, but uh, hey, we're in midwinter here, so any warming is welcome warming, I guess, for most, for most people. Just want to welcome uh, John to the weekend crew. We'll have the Saturday crew be doing the weather every uh, Saturday yeah, now. We've been, till, been here every now you know, and then, but uh, we'll be seeing it on a weekly basis there now. Always good, good, to be good, here. always good to work with you, John. Feelings mutual.